But it was all academic anyway, as the Quebec Nordiques defeated the Hartford Whalers 4-1 to to clinch the Eastern title. Joe Sackick led the way with his 19th goal and a pretty assist. And here's Sackick again, smoothly into the zone, and Fred Kovalenko scores! On another magical feed by Joe Sackick! The Nordiques finish the year with 19 wins, 4 ties, and just 1 loss at home. Welcome back as our show continues in the Eastern Conference. Stopped by Owen Nolan, then Sackick stole it to the back end of the car, and shoots, he scores! What a move by Joe Sackick! Quel arrêt de Stéphane Fizès! Here's Valerie Kaminsky with a slip shot, scores! What a blast! What a play! Basson and Krupp combining to put this one away. And a big, strong game for the Quebec Nordiques. The Quebec Nordiques are back. Their disappointing fifth-place finish last year seems a distant memory now that they're in the hands of a new general manager and coaching staff. The new general manager is Pierre Lacroix, and he made an instant impact last June by engineering a blockbuster trade with the Toronto Maple Leafs that resulted in bringing rugged winger Wendell Clark to Quebec City. Lacroix's other big move was to hire 33-year-old Mark Crawford to be his head coach. Crawford had never coached in the NHL, but that didn't mean he wasn't the right man for the job. I had Mark in, in junior hockey, and uh, uh, he was a great coach then, and I think he's a great coach now. He's young, he's played in the league, and I think he can uh, relate to the players a lot. Uh, he knows what they like, what they don't like, and uh, I think it's helping our team a great deal. He's won the support of the players. He... Uh, he, he definitely goes out there and he has quick hard practices, he uh, communicates well with the players, uh, he's very upfront, he's very forward, he's honest with the players, and it's, it's made something where the, the players are really gravitated to him because uh, they have a lot of trust and they, they like the system that he has brought into the team. Crawford has urged a greater commitment to defense, and that's been helped by some key additions. Sylvain Lefebvre came from Toronto along with Wendell Clark, and acquired from the Islanders was Huey Krupp. All the new guys have made a difference. It's not because last year we did have leadership, but when you're losing, it's hard to have some uh, some guys to stand up in the room and talk uh, to the players. But this year we got a winning team, and uh, when they'll bring some leadership, and you, we group, and Sylvain Lefebvre too, uh, I think they're three guys bring some confidence to the players too, and that helped the team this year. The Nordiques have won nine of their first ten games, and Stefan Fizet has been in goal for eight of them. Fizet leads a core of goaltenders that includes Jocelyn Thibault and Garth Snow. I know what I can do and I know I can play very good and uh, right now I'm playing good and the team is playing very good. I know Chesley is very good too and Garcino got a good season in the minor right now and uh, I don't feel any pressure. Uh, if I put some pressure on my shoulder, I'm not going to play good like I play right now. Messi against Finn, pass for Leach, save for set. That's a nice piece of goaltending is Reset stayed with Alexander Mogilny. Unbelievable back. That might be one of the greatest saves I've ever seen. But the key to it all remains Wendell Clark. Some wondered how he would take to Quebec, and Clark has provided the answer. It's a big trade. Uh, the Sly, the Fave, myself uh, went there, and we just want to go there with a positive attitude and uh, go in there. We knew that the, the team in Quebec had a lot of talent, and we just wanted to fit in and be one of the pieces of the puzzle. Clark has been playing left wing on a line with Andre Kovalenko and Joe Sackick. The qualities that Clark offers have been nothing short of great. He's been tremendous here, uh, just the leadership in the dressing room and on the ice. He's a tremendous player, and uh, uh, you know we're we're really fortunate uh, we got him in that deal. And uh, oh, I think we got the ingredients here, and uh, with a lot of leadership in that, uh, we're going to be fine. Add to the mix rookies with the talent of Peter Forsberg and the grit of Adam Dedmarsh, as well as the return of a healthy again Owen Nolan, and it seems the reconstructed Nordiques could have a lot to celebrate all year long.